A parliamentary committee is looking to allow people infected with COVID-19 to cast ballots in person on election day. The bill will be put up for a full floor vote next week. Yi kyung has the latest. National Assembly's Special Committee on Political Reform on Thursday approved a bill to extend voting time to 7.30 p.m. from the current 6 p.m. During that extra one hour and a half, those infected with COVID-19 will be able to cast their ballots in person. Currently on election day, voting is possible for those in self-isolation, but only for those who did not test positive. They can cast their ballots after regular voting ends at 6 p.m. for one hour until 7 p.m. Those infected are not eligible due to the mandatory seven-day self-isolation rule. The problem is, with the country's daily infections expected to top 170,000 by next month, nearly half a million people could potentially find themselves unable to vote. To prevent that from happening, both the ruling Democratic Party and the main opposition People Power Party had called for parliamentary efforts. I call for bipartisan efforts to come up with a measure to ensure the voting rights for those under self-isolation, both infected and not infected. Voting is the most sacred of rights. We must swiftly come up with a measure that people can trust. The two parties initially suggested extending voting to 9 p.m., but it was revised to 7.30 p.m. in a compromise with the National Election Commission, which said the current one-hour extension till 7 p.m. would be enough for all of those in self-isolation, infected and non-infected. The finalized bill will now be submitted to a plenary session for a vote and will likely be passed without controversy. Yang Eun, Arirang News.